Welcome to my Groove video review. Today I'm going to give you a live demo of Groove video. I'm going to show you exactly what it is. And I'm pretty excited because I just came back from vacation. Seeing that Groove video was live together with Groove member, but I will create a separate video for Groove member. Um, but right now I'm going to show you Groove video, which is an uh, alternative to Wistia, similar service like Wistia. Now, if you don't know anything about Groove, uh, Groove is a complete platform like you see here uh, with all marketing tools that you need to create websites, for example, to sell your products online, uh, to upload your videos, to create membership sites, to send out emails, to create webinars, etc. And right now uh, you can get this for a one time purchase. So if you're interested in that, below this video, there is a link where you can create a free Groove Pages account and Groove Cell account. Uh, to get you started anyway back to groove video and let me show you what this is so right now i'm logged in and to add a new video it works really simple you click on add video and then you give your video a name here so groove video demo and also your description of your video and then you can start creating your video or uploading your video now Right now, I need to upload my video so you can click here or you can simply drag and drop. So let's say this is the video that I want to upload. I can upload this to Groove Video. I need to click on Upload Video. Then it will upload the video. This is a simple video of 10 megabytes just uh, for the example of this uh, review video. And as you can see right now, it's encoding the video. So it's creating a better version to uh, show this online on your website so that it's optimized for desktops, mobiles, etc., on every different kind of connection. Now, once that is done, you can also add extra elements to your page. First, you can choose if your video needs to be responsive or fixed. Probably, most probably, we're all going to use responsive, but in some cases, a fixed size can be uh, useful. And then at the settings, uh, it becomes more interesting because here you can upload your splash image and your logo watermark. So you simply click on choose image and then you could choose your splash image. So let's say this is my splash image. This is the one that I want to use. Then you select this image and it will be added to your video. So right now it's still encoding the video and this takes a little while. This is similar uh, to what you see on YouTube, etc. But you will notice that once it's done, this splash image will show uh, in a few seconds, minutes. Then you also have the option to choose a logo watermark. I noticed that this is not working yet. Uh, what you need to know that right now Groove Video has become available, but still in beta mode. So that's also what you're seeing right now. It's in beta mode. Uh, so you will be able to add a logo to your video also. Now, what I'm going to do is I go back to another video so I can show you how it works because the encoding is still working here. When I go back to my videos in here, uh, I'm going to edit another one so that you can see oh, the processing is, is complete. So we can go back to the other video because the processing is complete. And when I go to edit, you can see that this video is now available here at the right side and it's already playing. Okay, I'm recording this video to upload into Groove Video so that I can as you can see, this was the video that I created that I uploaded to Groove Video. And when I go back to settings, uh, you saw the splash image at the start. So when I refresh my screen, you see that splash image is already working. Uh, but we have more in the call to action. So first in settings, you can do multiple things. So you could mute on start. So when the video starts playing, when I select this and I start playing my video, you will see it starts muting without any audio. So that's one of the possibilities. Another option is to change the colors of your players. You can see the colors are changing while it's playing. Um, and let me stop this mute on start. You could auto play on load. So when the website is loading, you could auto play the video and you could also do an overlay title. So let me mute on start again. So you can see it. I want to have an title overlay. So let's say uh, Groove Video uh, Review. So when I do this and I start playing my video, look what happens at the left corner. It says Groove Video Review here. So this is a title 
that you can add yourself or you could just unselect this so that there's no title. Personally, I like that better, but some people like to have that. I accidentally skipped to the previous page. Okay, so these are the settings part. Now here comes a very interesting part, which is call to actions. With Groove Video, you have the possibility to add actions to your video. So when I click on new call to action, I could choose here from an opt-in form. So when I click next, I can say after an X amount of seconds of an X amount of minutes or hours, I want to have an opt-in form. So let's say you have, let's put this on three seconds so you can see immediately how it works. I can say opt-in to watch the full video, something like that. And you could also do a skip button or you could say, no, people really need to fill out these details to see the video. And then I click on create. Now what happens is when I start playing the video after three seconds, look what happens. Okay, I'm recording this video to upload into and boom, people have to opt in to watch this full video. So when I do Tim and I do TA Verdau, let's say at blah, blah, blah.com and I submit Google this for, so boom, I, can I captured the email address and the video continues playing. Now, this is one opt-in form, uh, one call to action, but you actually can add unlimited call to action. So let's say uh, I also want to add a banner to my video. I'm going to click next and I say, okay, after six seconds, I want to add a banner. So this could be uh, something like click here to purchase, or let's say this is my banner here. This is just uh, for the example, but this could be purchase now, for example. And then you could do HTTPS and then your website.com. And you could also do skip button. So let us let me show you how that works. So let me click on create. As you can see, I now have two call to actions here. Let me actually uh, remove myself from the screen here. Uh, as you can see here, now you have two call to actions uh, in this video. So first, when we start playing the video. Okay, I'm recording this video to upload into Google. There is the opt-in form. So there we fill out our name and our email address. And then we click on submit Move video so that I can see and that you can see. And boom, there is the image. So when people click on this it image, works. it will Inside open the video, it be here. A simple video. It opened a Just new for, website with the URL that we configured here in this call to action. So the next one is the text overlay. So you could add a lower third text overlay on top of your video. So uh, this would be, for example, uh, click here for more info. And then we could also hyperlink this one to our website, your website.com. And we could say, okay, I want to display this uh, from seven seconds to 14 seconds, for example, and let's create this one. So what now happens is after seven seconds, uh, this new call to action will show up in the video. It takes a little long to load now. There it is. I'm going to get rid of the opt-in form so I don't have to opt-in in this demo. And as you can see here, I'm going to hit okay, play. I'm recording this video to upload into Groove Video so that I can see. So after six seconds, see. boom, people can purchase your product here when they click on this or they can skip here at the right How top. It works inside of Groove Video. This is and as you can see here at the bottom, just it's just click uh, here for purposes, more info so you can see uh, where they can works. click to at your product. Moment, it only allows you to... So these so these are the few call to actions. Then there is a last one, uh, which is a text overlay with call to action. So this one is not working at this moment, but this allows you to do a text overlay in front of your video uh, where you can say, okay, from five seconds to 10 seconds, I want to add this text with this URL. But right now, because it's in beta, this one is not working yet. And these are the possibilities with Groove Video. Now, uh, also you can do an end action. You can just end the video or loop this from the beginning. And when you save this video, it is ready to use on any website. So you can grab here the embed code, and this will be similar to YouTube, uh, YouTube embed code. So when you go, for example, into Groove Pages into your website builder, here, let me go to Groove Pages. Let me quickly create a demo page to show you how it works here. Demo Pages. 
and let me go to my pages here let me cl quickly create one from a template let's say uh, let me pick one it doesn't really matter which one let's say we select this one how it works is like this um, you simply go to the elements. So here's a video already. What you're gonna do is you go to elements and you scroll down here and you simply drag and drop the embed code in here. Uh, in the future, there will be a groove video icon here where you could drag and drop groove video in here and then you can choose your video. Right now, that's not available yet. So we're going to paste our video code in here. And when we save, you can see the video has been added to our website. Let me get rid of this video because otherwise we will have two videos on this page. Um, and right now when I click save and I'm going to preview this page, you will notice that the video is there. This is Groove video that will be on this page. It's not being added right now. I'm not sure why that is. Boom, boom, boom. It should be on this page. Let me see what happens if I do online HTML editor, if I paste the code. Probably it could be possible that I don't have the complete code. Oh, there it is. Here you can see the video. Okay, I'm recording this video to upload into Groove Video so that I can see and that you can see. Boom, you see there's a splash image where people could skip. How it works inside of Groove. Okay, so uh, probably I have done something wrong, not sure what, or I need to publish this page. But basically, this is how you add Groove Video to your website. Let me look one more time. Well, it should, it should, pro it should work. Not sure why it's not working. I've tested this before on another page where it was working. But, uh, but basically, this is how you add the video to your website, to your Groove pages. Let me go back to Groove Video uh, because there's a little bit more to show you inside of Groove Video, um, you will also have integration. So by default, you can upload your videos, but you could also add your own S3, Amazon S3 integration so that you could use your own videos that you've uploaded to your S3 integration. Also, you could choose to have your own encoder from Coconut or encoding.com uh, where you could add these encoders as well. Then we also got the analytics where you can see all your videos. You can see the impressions, the uniques, the finishes, total watch time, etc. And uh, right now it's not available, but there will also be a tagging system inside of Groove Video. So this is a very early review of Groove Video, but just to give you a good idea of what Groove Video is all about. Uh, but there will also be a tagging system that, for example, when somebody has watched the first five minutes, you can give them a tag that will automatically trigger an email inside of Groove uh, mail, for example, where you can email someone after someone has watched your video for five minutes, if that person is on your list, for example. So it will be very uh, advanced system that works really well with everything inside of Groove Funnels. Now, again, if you're interested in Groove Funnels, there's a link below this description uh, where you can create your free account uh, and if you want to, you can upgrade to the full plan for a one-time price. If you have any further questions about Groove Video, uh, let me know in the comments below. Uh, I hope you like this video. Let me go back to the screen. I hope you like this video. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you like this video. And uh, thank you for watching. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.